Hello everybody, this is Nizcraft, and today we're going to be delivering three wyvern eggs in the forest and hills. It's from the Lady Gourmet. I travel the world for new tastes and flavors. Now I want to try the egg of a wyvern. Please, bring me three wyvern eggs. So, this is a gathering quest, and it's an egg quest, and I really hate egg quests. So I looked up a guide on how to do this, and we came a little bit prepared. So hopefully this goes smoothly. We only have 30 minutes to do it, but we'll grab all of this stuff. We will go ahead and ration up. Then we will head out to area five to the nest. So the way that this quest works, at least according to the guide that I read, is that the loss of prey will spawn in areas three, two, and one after you pick up the egg the first time. And so the idea is that uh, that is supposed to make it difficult for you to make it back to the camp with your eggs because you're dealing with these areas full of the lost prey. But the guide says that if you run into five, pick up an egg, drop it, then come back to four, three, two, one, and just clear out all of the Velociprey, then you should be smooth sailing. We'll see if that works. There is a Rathalos around. We can hear it. I'm going to paint it. See if we can get away from it. Whoa, that was kind of close. And so we're going to have to deal with the Rathalos a little bit. So we have these Velociprey in here. I don't think we need to worry about them just yet. Unless it jumps up here and like knocks us over. Alright, so we got our Wyvern Egg. Right. Looks like Rathalos is coming to five. That's fine. We don't really care. We're back in four. Or is it flying on to six? Rathalos is so stupid sometimes. Um, I did bring some power juice. We have three of them. And so we will be using these when we come to get our first, second, and third egg, basically. All right. One philosopher down. All right. Let's check this way first. No hidden prey. and all of the prey in three are done. So hopefully these prey will not spawn. Babel Spear is pretty awesome. Can take these guys down in a single hit with the draw attack. Um, it's still two hits for most of their attacks. But the fact that the draw attack takes them down with one is pretty great. Right. Rathalos is in nine, just chilling out. That's cool. And then here we have. Rathalithera, not Rathalos, we have our Velociprey here in one. Alright, 
that one's done. Come on, buddy. Okie dokie. So, uh, ooh, there's a Velocity right there. This is a sneaky one. It'd be easy to miss this one until you come over there with an egg. Alright. So, the hope is now that all of the prey are gone from two, and all of the prey are gone from three when we return. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. So now I think we're going to go to five, kill the Velociprey, grab our power juice, pick up the egg, and then deliver it home. Hopefully we can avoid Rathalos as much as possible. I thought it was going to five for a second and was like, ah, please no. Right, one prey down. Usually there's like more than just the one over there. We're going to jump up here. Power juice it up. Stamina has stopped decreasing. We have a wyvern egg. And now we can run our little heart out. This is as fast as we can go. Ooh, all right, we want to go this way so that we don't fall off the big hill. And then we're just a uh, we're just playing Dodge the Rathalos. So I guess I can talk a little bit about what I want to do with this series. Um, I've been having a lot of fun coming back to it um, after all these years. Still no Velocipray. So I've had a lot of fun coming back to it after all these years. It feels really nice to have what is almost the full Rathalo set, and to have this really, really good Iron Lance. I feel like Rathalos is following us, trying to catch up to us. Apologize, I keep changing the subject. I'm really scared of that Rathalos. Um, so yeah, it feels really good to have, like, I worked really hard for this Rathalos armor set. Uh, I worked really hard for this lance, the spear, and that feels really good. I am excited to kind of get to the credits of this game, um, which is kind of facing the final urgent of the village. And then we're probably going to take a little break. There are some optional quests that you can do after the Urgent. They uh, let you fight some new monsters, and um, okay, what's the right button? Is it X or is it Circle? Okay, it's X. Ooh, I have delivered an egg all the way here only to drop it with the wrong button before. Um, so like I was saying, there are some optional monsters that we could fight after defeating the final urgent. 
Uh, we might come back and do those at some point, but I think I'm going to take a break. I have been spending a lot of time on this game lately, and that seems like a good stopping point. So that's kind of the plan. We are pretty much geared up as much as I want to be to finish the game. Our speed burst is done. That's like perfect timing. I was watching Shepard, who is a Monster Hunter streamer, play through this game um, not too long ago, and they actually finished it with the Spiked Spear Lance, which is that Lance that we had when we first defeated Rathalos. Um, Hey, the Velasa prayer gone. That's awesome. We'll take our power juice. And so, um, I know that technically the game was beatable. Not, like, like way back then. Way back when I first defeated Rathalos. It, it's just a matter of skill. And probably some luck. But I feel really good. I needed to to feel like I really played the game. I needed to grind out a good armor set, grind out a good weapon, and use that to finish the game. And that's what I think I'm going to do. There is like the possibility that if I get lucky or something, in the meantime, I'm able to get the, the final Rathalos piece that I need to make the head. Which would be just awesome. But I, I really don't think that's going to happen. I'm probably not going to get lucky and get the final Basarios piece. I need to make the Basarios weapon, which is a poison lance. Probably not going to fight any more Plesioth. Uh, I really did not enjoy that fight very much. Probably not going to fight any more Plesioth. And so we're not going to get the Plesioth weapon. I think we're just going to kind of power through to the end. Finish up the game. Finish up the last few quests. Which there's only really a couple. Like there's a... I you know there's a Rathian in the swamp. And... This quest, I don't remember what else there is. I feel like there's another one. But I don't remember what it might be. Besides the urgent. And so there might be only a couple more episodes left for us to finish this off. All right. Egg delivery number two. Perfecto. Easy peasy. The only problem here is we don't have a paintball on Rathalos anymore. So we don't know where it is. It seemed like, at least the pattern for the last two eggs, was that it pretty steadily followed us from area to area, but it didn't seem to come into the next area until we left the area that we were in. So there, there's probably some sort of timer on it where if you really dilly-dally, Rathalos will catch up to you in whatever area you're in. Let's see, if it's already left three, it's probably in nine. So what I think is going to happen is we're going to get up there. We're going to grab the egg, get our power juice. Well, we're going to get our power juice, then we're going to grab the egg. And then Rathalos is going to go to six. And as soon as we enter four, it's going to go to five. And as soon as we enter three, it's going to go to four. So on and so forth. I, think, I don't think we're going to see Rathalos again. But if I'm wrong, oh boy. 
dash juice. And a wyvern egg. The dash juice represents the very last of my bitter bugs. Oh no, I guess Rathalos is coming here. I can hear the wings. My heart just like started beating really fast. Um, yeah, so this dash juice represents the last of my bitter bugs. Um, I think I'm out of blue mushrooms again. Might have to get some more blue mushrooms before we take on the urgent. Um, I did craft all of, I crafted a whole bunch of potions before we took on Plesioth, and we might have to do that again. Um, but I'm really kind of like running low on those types of materials. I didn't have any. Power extract is, I think, what it's called from Gypsaros, which is how you can make the Mega Dash Juice. Or, um, no, it's not called Mega Dash Juice. We made Power Extract, or we made Power Juice. There, there's like another, there's like a better juice. I don't remember what it is. Um, but I didn't have this stuff to make the better juice. And so if I was going to have to stick around and maybe redo this quest, then uh, things might get a little bit rough. So we heard there at the end, Rathalos roared its way into two. We escaped just in time. I don't think Rathalos will come to one, but it's possible that it will. I'm guessing they coded it so that once you picked up the final egg, Rathalos followed you a little bit faster. And there we are! Final, our final egg delivered. The, uh, the Lady Gourmet must be very pleased with us. We're gonna run this way and see if we can just gather a few more blue mushrooms before the end of the quest. Oh, I forgot that delivery quests were like 20 seconds instead of a minute. It probably told me on the screen. All right, we got nutrients, we got some honey, and we got another egg ticket. Wonderful. I have no idea what the egg tickets are even used for. But yeah, that was a quest. That was our last egg delivery quest of Monster Hunter. Let's go take a look at our quest list and see what we have left. So we need to slay the Rathian in the Swamp Zone. We've fought Gendrome, we've fought Plesioth, we've fought Rathalos, we've delivered the Wyvern Eggs. So unless there is a hidden quest that we haven't done yet, this will be our next quest where we take on the Rathian. So thank you so much for watching. I'm trying to think. I don't, I don't think I have enough antidotes. might have to go get some more blue mushrooms just so I can make some antidotes before we take on Matthew. So thank you so much for watching. This was Nuscraft. Have a good one.